Training was some of the best training I've been able to take part in since I joined the Marine Corps, and I'm really grateful for the chance to be able to go out there and do this kind of thing. We had gone out to, to go check out some labs and what they had looked like, just some labs that were within our capability gap, and how to identify them based off of what the lab looked like. In the first week, we were in a classroom environment the whole time, and the second week, we were more so going into scenarios and the full mission profile and we were given a mission and we were told make sure this place can be occupied by another unit. So it was our job to go in there and prove whether there was some kind of chemical weapon, some kind of biological weapon, nuclear, so on and so forth. It went really smoothly. All the teams had responded really well. Everybody had played their part and as a team, I think that this platoon is pretty solid. Most days, uh, we were well over 100 degrees, uh, and the humidity was almost like swimming. So getting in a suit was very different, especially with the respirators and trying to figure out how to breathe with that moist air. Um, I enjoyed it a lot in the fact that it pushed us a lot more than we're used to. So just the fact that we were able to get some hardships in our different scenarios that we were training for, uh, that way we could all get that, that atmosphere of conflict. Tactically, to neutralize these threats, it's going to get a lot more capabilities to the rest of the units, and it's also going to help protect Marines wherever we go. So if we need to go find out who is doing what and where they were doing it and why they were doing it, it could also help prevent tomorrow's disasters today.